This tutorial is for the product reviews app by Shopify. Okay, it's one of the most popular uh, product reviews apps on the Shopify App Store. This is not for judge me reviews or for Yotpo reviews or any of the other reviews apps. I'll be making separate videos for those. So what I'm going to show you today is how to remove these stars if a product doesn't have any reviews, right? So you don't want your customers to see this kind of empty stars and no reviews. And the same thing for the uh, related products. If they don't have reviews, we can hide these stars. And actually for the entire collection page, also we can hide, uh, hide these empty stars for any products that don't have a single review. So how do we hide this? It's actually pretty easy because as you can see here in the code, this um, the Shopify product reviews badge has um, has this attribute, it says data rating, and then 0.0. .0. Okay, so this is basically the value of the stars. And if it's 0.0, .0 that means that there have has not been any rating yet. Okay, so we can actually target this with CSS. Um, so this is what the CSS looks like. It targets any badge with the data rating of 0.0. .0 and then it hides it. Okay, so we just need to take this. And I'll include this in the video description. And then we're going to go into online store and then themes. And I'll actually show you. We want to get into the code editor. So we're going to go to online store and themes. And then under your published theme, you're going to go actions, and click edit code. Okay, and that will bring you to your theme files, you're going to search for um, styles.scss.liquid, or you can search for any file with the ending scss, it might not be called styles, it might be called main or something like that. But you're looking for your main, uh, your main style sheet, okay, your your main CSS file, it may even be CSS without the s. So once you find that, what you're going to do is scroll to the very bottom of it. And you'll find a place for custom styles. Maybe it's Maybe there isn't a heading like this, but just scroll down to the bottom. And that's where we're going to add this code. So I've copied it from here. I'm going to paste it in here. Let's just clean it up a bit. So it looks nice. And we're going to save. And that's all there is to it really. This is going to hide any badge with a data rating of zero. Okay, so let's refresh this and see if it worked. So no stars here. No stars in our uh, related products either. And as soon as we add a review, so submit review, and the stars should appear. And they don't. When you're making a video tutorial, things don't work. Okay. <laughs> so actually, the reviews just take a bit of time to show up. But basically, all I did was refresh a few times. And finally, my stars are showing up with one review. Um, the related products still don't have reviews. So their empty stars are not showing up. And this change should also be working on the collection page. So I haven't refreshed since I added the code. Um, so I'm going to refresh now and we should see reviews for this product. But we should not see review stars for any of the other products. And there we go. This may put things out of alignment, by the way. So it depends on the design of your website, uh, whether you want to do this or not. If you have any questions, please leave a comment. Um, if you found this video helpful, 
leave a like, and I'll see you next time.